in this world, when you choose the behavior, it comes with consequences. And whatever behavior you choose, good behavior, bad behavior, whatever, it comes with a certain consequence. And when you, you say guys don't stay with you, you're not exactly generating a profile that makes a guy want to take you home to meet mom. Um, uh, yes, I do. Some guys I dated. Like, I dated a guy for three months. Yeah, well, that's yeah. not exactly a lifetime. But, um, but it's interesting that whether you're putting on some act to get attention or whether you <laughs> genuinely have a distorted view of life or whatever, doesn't really matter because even if you are putting on an act to get attention, what's important to me is why you chose this particular act instead of another act. I mean, it all, I, I spend most of my time hearing what people don't say. I, I look at all behavior the same. And it's interesting that everything you do, the way you describe the guys that you want, the things that you portray yourself to be on the internet, the things you say about the way you want to be treated, the way you seem to have this fixation on negative Im input, the way you run from positive input, uh, all tells me that you love being in the victim role and that you love being in a situation where you're punished and put down, <laughs> and that tells me that you have absolutely no self-worth, no self-esteem, and yes, no self-respect. I have a high self-esteem. I don't, I don't care if people think about it. I have a high self-esteem. Because anybody that had self-esteem, self-worth, and self-respect would not allow random guys to use their body as a playground. Mm -hmm. They would not allow random guys to, <laughs> they would not allow random guys to entertain themselves in such a way that could leave you with a disease or a pregnancy or uh, a situation or circumstance where you were hurt, uh, killed, or left in a life circumstance that you would pay for for years to come and no one with self-worth or self-esteem would allow themselves to be used and manipulated that way and then dilute themselves that this is something they want. And that tells me that uh, whether it's because, as you said, that your mother wasn't there for you and that you feel that your dad bailed on you when he had a stroke and you got left on your own and you were cute and so you got attention for that, so you started using the currency that you had. Um, it just tells me that uh, your self-worth and self-esteem is absolutely on the floor and I hate that for you. No, it's not because I don't hook up with every guy. I'm not like that. I go on dates. I only hook up the second date if he's my type. I don't hook up with every guy. I'm not like that. Yeah. I have standards. Yeah. Um, <laughs> trust me, if you don't think that you won't wind up on the internet with somebody that will yeah. rape you yeah. or somebody that will me. cut your throat and leave that you for dead. That would never happen to me. Nothing bad ever happened, ever. It's not going to happen. I, would really hope that somewhere you would set a goal to say, you know what, that's all fun and games and I get lots of attention for it, but there's more to me than that and I need to treat myself better than the way I'm treating myself.